Okay, I picked the hottest day of the year so far to do this video. I want to talk about the different types of hybrid systems that are on the Toyotas nowadays. If you know Toyota, you know that they are synonymous with hybrids. Well, did you know that there are now two different hybrid systems out there? They are very different. And as I started putting this video together, I realize that there are a lot of videos out there that use cool graphics and cutaways and all sorts of stuff like that. I don't have any of that. My production value is about zero. However, what I also found is that every video out there gets way far into the weeds and stuff that just doesn't matter. So what I have here, this is what Toyota used to refer to as a Synergy Drive hybrid system. They don't use the term Synergy Drive anymore. Don't ask me why. They just call this the fifth generation or fifth generation hybrid system. Well, it works like all of our other hybrids ever have right up until the one I'm going to tell you about in a second. You have an engine, you have two electric motors, you actually don't have a real transmission. You have a type of a CVT, but even that isn't, isn't what most people think of as a continuously varying transmission. It uses one of the electric motors and the gas engine. It combines the two power sources into a single output. Uh, it works really, really well. It is incredibly reliable. The stupid thing lasts forever. You, you essentially can't break them. This system is set up for efficiency. This thing gets, this is the uh, Toyota Crown, this one gets 42 miles to the gallon combined. It is an amazingly efficient system. That's what everybody is used to with a hybrid system. There's a new system, it's called the MAX system. Anytime you see Toyota referred to as a hybrid MAX, it's a little bit different. In fact, it's a lot different. It still has a gas engine, but it is going to be a turbocharged gas engine. It is not going to have two electric motors and is running off of this power split device. It's going to have one big electric motor and a conventional transmission. In the case of the Crown and the Grand Highlander, it's a six-speed automatic transmission. Well, here's the way that that one works. That one is not set up for efficiency. It is set up for power, an amazing amount of power, an intoxicating amount of power. And it works on a completely different principle. So the whole idea is you've got a turbocharged gas engines. Turbochargers make a lot of torque. They give you a ton of power, but it takes a little bit for it to spool up. And what that means is you don't get that power immediately. The engine has to rev up a little bit and then it kicks in. Well, that's fine because they made it up to that big electric motor. That An electric motor develops all of its torque immediately. So when you step on the gas pedal, the electric motor gives you that thrust, that power off the line, that torque that you wanna feel. That gets you going for long enough for the turbocharger to spool up. Now the turbocharger is giving you its power. You have power all over the place with this thing. And that's what it's designed for. It is designed to get you moving and get you moving right now. It only gets 30 miles to the gallon, which is better than a V6 engine. It's a lot more powerful than the V6 that it replaces. This thing has 340 horsepower. It's an amazing powertrain. So you can get the old style hybrid. I call it old style, but you know, we are in the fifth generation of it now and it's a great hybrid system. That's for efficiency and enough power that most people are satisfied with it. But if you want that power to throw you back in the seat, get the max hybrid system. That one is awesome, but it's a different hybrid system. You do have a conventional transmission. You do have, you know, you don't have a lot of the, uh, the efficiency benefits that you do out of a conventional hybrid system. So, two hybrid systems. The conventional, what used to be called the Synergy Drive, and now the Max hybrid system. Hope this is helpful. If it is, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.